Hey everybody, welcome back. Channel's Game On, where we're just gaming on. My name's Lucky, and we've got more Dragon's Dogma 2 for, or Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. I'm sorry. Not ready for Dragon's Dogma 2, that's not until the end of the month. Where we'll be doing a few, full blind let's play of that with a review. Now, back to Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Thanks for checking us out here, I really appreciate it, you guys. Um, we did the first quest of the second part, basically the second third of the main story. We did the first quest of that, which was to hunt down the griffin and fight him, and it was an epic quest. Let's go back over it for a second, because it was so epic. Started out heading south, I'll show you on the map here. So we started off heading south, this way. We left Grand Soren, and we headed south down here. And we had to lay some bait in this area for the griffin. We had to kill a goblin, actually carry him over, put him in the circle. Then the griffin came, we fought him. The griffin flew off all the way over to the Blue Moon Tower, which is over here. We had to walk. Well, we actually fast traveled from here all the way to there. Then we had to walk through this entire area, which was extremely deadly. <clears throat> Everything there was way more powerful than we are. This is like a very, very end game section on the map, which I think is so cool that it took you on an actual main story quest to one of the last parts of the game where it knew it was going to be hard for you. It knew you weren't ready for this, but you were going to have to slog through it. So no matter what you do, it was going to be difficult. A long enough run that you're going to have to deal with nighttime at some point, no matter what you do. We ended up just booking it through the last section of that just to get to the moon tower, blue moon tower, excuse me, where we had to climb up, <clears throat> fight skeleton mages and skeletons all up the blue moon tower, get attacked by the griffin, do like a run and hide and get through gate section of it where we couldn't actually hurt him, but we had to deal with him and get away from him. Then we finally had to fight him on the very top of the tower. And in the middle of the fight, the guy that we found Solomon's Grimoire and gave it to him, the, the mage, <clears throat> he came and helped us in the fight. Ah, it was epic. Um, so go check it out if you guys didn't see that one. But you want to talk about a main quest and an RPG quest, that's probably one of the best quests I've ever done in any game, to be honest. I mean, straight up, just thinking about it, that was actually difficult. Now, instead of getting into the second mission right here for the main quest, we're going to go and take care of a bunch of these side quests. We've got a rousing suspicion where we have to meet Mirabelle at night. We have Nameless Terror, which is somebody stalking us, and we just got to be aware. The Idol Worship would be nice because we could bring that to the Weaponsmith. And the weapon, and well, he's not really a weaponsmith, uh, to the guy that sells weapons, and he'll give us a whole new category of weapons. <clears throat> Rise of the Fallen. we got to investigate the secret meeting of Salvation's clandestine meeting. And then we have to meet Chamberlain Fidel on the Conspirators one. Yeah, so we're going to take care of all of those here. Starting with, let's do all the nighttime ones here. Where's this idol one at? I wonder if I can just find this idol first. It seems like an easy, fun one. Now, I did find it in the last playthrough. I don't remember where it was. I just randomly found it. And I was like, oh, this is a weird bronze idol. I don't know what, what this means. What do I do with this? So, of course, I don't remember now where it is. And it doesn't show me with that quest marker. So, we're going to switch to... Arousing Suspicion. We'll just take care of this one tonight. Although I don't see any quest marker for it. I'm pretty sure it's uh, here in this town. So we'll go and we'll switch it to nighttime. I'm sorry. Get out the way. That's cool how it carried me a little bit right there. What errand could demand an audience so What could Lady Eleanor require of what you at such an hour? Foe. What a fearsome but our task foe. is done. But our task is done. It was a fearsome foe. Okay, well. But our task yes, is yes, done. yes. Put it all on repeat. I've detailed our nearest estimate of their meeting place upon your map. Above all, see that you are not discovered in your search. Quiet as a... <coughs> you are well, I hope? I am well. heavy though. Look at us. We can barely run. I like the new addition of armor though. 
I don't know if I can get up this way, though. Nope. Jump over that midget. Hello. The idols are said to come in various forms. Which you secure is not important, so long as it permits me to parlay huh. with the weaponsmith. I trust your skill is on measure with the task, or I would not ask it of you. The master works all, you can't go wrong. Hmm. The master okay. works all, you can't come again. Cool. Well, let's enhance. Let's see if we can enhance the anything. Which you I trust. The so I didn't know there were different all. idols. I've only found a bronze idol. So neither of those can get upgraded yet. Trusty sword can. Font of fire, all those guys can't. We don't need to do those yet. Master works all. Come again. Yeah, so I mean, it wasn't much that I could actually upgrade, so we'll just more bother. But let's see about. It's a cool looking hood, but. I'm gonna stick with the really nice one. I wish I could wear this armor. The sectional iron plate, that stuff looks cool as hell, but I can't. Yeah, the red leather's cool looking, but we're not gonna wear that. Bracers, yeah, not good enough. So <clears throat> drop a bunch of this stuff off. This inn must serve as the hub of. Then we'll go and change it to nighttime. Get off the special. Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? Be today. Have your pick. Any you like. See about the new skills. Be it's been a while since we've looked. <clears throat> what was the magic rebuffer? I forgot about that one. Plunges one's blade into the ground to form a magic sizzle. Improves magic defense when facing the undead. Yeah, okay, that's cool, but not cool enough. Loose is a magical arrow that fortifies an ally against reeling from enemy blows. Magical arrow that makes an ally impervious to all manner of debilitations for a time. Funnel trail. Loose is a magical arrow that draws in nearby lightweight enemies. That one's cool. <clears throat> the true seeker might be the one. Halves the severity of injuries you sustain from falling. I think that's going to come in handy. But I think that True Seeker. We're going to figure out how to use Levitate to get access to some cool spots, I'll tell you that. But right now we're going to get True Seeker to make our lock on go better. We'll get Levitate anyways. Okay, that's all we need right now. Oh, I can't. Magical Gleam, an advanced form of magical flare that illuminates a broader area for a longer period of time. That one is cool. 
I haven't really used the explosive bolt at all. I need to use that and actually try it and see if I like it. What will it. it be today? Have your pick. Any you like. What will it be today? Okay, let's, let's change this tonight here and we get on. So I want to find the Hydra too eventually here. See if we can fight that. Found plenty of Chimera, plenty of Goblins, plenty of that stuff, but no Hydra yet. Saw a dragon even. Night is come. I Nightfall Master. There was all Mirabella awaits you within the castle. Okay, well, let's talk to Madeline first. A knightly customer? Surely tis not jealousy steers your quest. I have eyes, only you'll find... That's interesting. Fine... Her dialogue changed with nighttime. Flamica. You'll find not... Go ahead and check the weapons. It's all the same. The gloaming shoes. Jet black shoes that melt into the night. Lightweight for dancing through the shadows. Okay. And anybody can wear them. But they're not very good. Find not. Thank you very much. So no. Gotta go meet Miss Mirabel at the castle. Well. Yeah. This way it is faster because we can parkour our way there. Oh, uh, that's the... Yeah, right over here. Mirabelle, Mirabelle, wherever art thou. Well met, sir. See, we have access to the castle at all hours of the night. <clears throat> the night watch is currently on patrol. If you stay here, you may be discovered and thrown in the dungeon. Oh, really? The hell? Okay, so we gotta kinda be careful. Is that what it's telling me? This is like a sneak, a little bit of a sneak mission. Even though we don't uh, have any kind of crouch or Reason, stealth, really. You've come, Arisen. Oh, this is glorious. Most glorious. Pardon me, sir. Forgive the ramblings of a handmaiden on a strange errand. It's only. My lady's request to see you is a rare thing, you see. A first in all my years with her, in truth. I trust you understand the delicacy of the situation. My lady is a married woman, I need not remind you. And well, yes, even innocent conversation could be bent foul were it discovered by others. Pray, walk softly, Arisen. And have a care to let none find you visiting my lady's chamber. Oh ho ho! Meet Eleanor by night. Worry not after his grace, Arisen. He's not set foot within my lady's chambers since the wedding night. Yet his guard remains ever watchful. Take care to avoid discovery. Can't leave a lady in waiting alone. She's not a lady in waiting. Can't leave your wife all alone and ignore her like that. Expect her to stick around and want to be with you. Come on. Okay, so. Oh hell. We gotta remember there's guards and stuff here. And so <clears throat> no, I have. Let's stick to the shadows. I wonder if I lock on anything here. There's a guy right there. We were supposed to talk to about our conspiracy. But instead, I think what we're going to do. Right there's a guard too. See that? Where's he gonna go? He's going inside. We'll do that mission with the conspirators later. I think we have to go this way to get up there. If I remember correctly. <clears throat> The lady is... Is she that way? I think it's this way. It's over there. How do I get there again? It's that tower over there. See the point of it right there, guys? Hmm. I forget how exactly to get there. It's actually from inside the castle. Well, 
we've actually got a sneak in there. <clears throat> I thought this was gonna lead us there as well. <laughs> Might as well talk to you while we're here. Ah, you've come. You must forgive me the secrecy. The matter demands it, I assure you. I dare not speak it aloud, so pray. Listen, truth be told, I have long traveled the land in secret, keeping watch over the Duke's army. Now I feel my investigation has borne fruit. Oh, One internal affairs. Vast supplies far beyond their need. Their regimen of training, too, defies comparison. His Grace must know of this, thought I, and so drafted a letter to send the moment I found a courier I could trust. But fate is cruel, sir, and the pack I'd place the letter was snatched by monsters out on the roads. If someone should find that missive, and its contents become known to the public, morale will crumble. What's more, a secret serves use only so long as it stays hidden. Their treason will be more easily foiled if they do not expect the Duke to know of it. The letter must be found. Surely you understand, sir. I would ask you to find it. And retrieve it here to me. Well, we can do our best, right? Naturally, His Grace cannot openly compensate <coughs> for this task, but I shall gladly pay you of my own pockets should you succeed. I was traveling the roads when I was attacked, came from the air, swooping down long enough to snatch up my pack. Griffin, right? And like as not carried it back to their nest, though where that may be, I know not. The mountains near the Great Wall are nest to many a flying creature, though. Perhaps there is the best place to start. The facial animations for the voice dialogue is so funny to me. Their face doesn't even move half the time he's talking. Yeah, okay, well, we will do that eventually. But first things first, we're going to talk to Miss Eleanor. And it's going to be really hard because... Shoot! He's right there. Um... Hmm. Wish I had a rock. I got rid of all my rocks. Uh, there's no rocks over here. I don't even know if you can throw a rock like I'm going to try to do. But let me kind of go the other way then. Fig Is that a guard right there? No, I'm just tripping. I'm just losing it. I don't want to go through the front, you know. That seems like an obvious, hey, stop. Let's go all the way around to this side. Oh, there's a rock. There. So can I equip and throw that? Yes, you totally can. Okay. Okay. Uh, that was my only rock, though. There's got to be more. Flask of water. That's cool. <sighs> the first time ever in this game I want a rock. Okay, this will work out good. I think. I don't want the bucket. Damn, I wish I had just one rock to go in there with. I don't really want to go in there without something to throw as a distraction, but I kind of wasted my chance. Let's see if there's anybody in here. Oh, God. Yep, there he is. Shoot. I love stealthing in a non-stealth game. Walking right at me, wasn't he? It's all those guys. Uh oh, I hear steps. Well, 
get out of here. That was close. Okay, okay. So that guy's there. I saw another guy up top just now. We're gonna make for this. And we're gonna go here. I've never been up here and I've never done this quest. There's that guy. Yep. Oh, that's where I need to go, I think. Ah, shite. Ah, shite. Trapped. Ah, fuck. This isn't good. Oh, he's not a guard. <laughs> that guy is, I bet. Hi. Huh. That was weird. Maybe there were guards. I think this is the spot, though. Yes, this is it. Okay, guys, we made it. I guess once we get to that upper level, you don't have to worry about the guards, because there were definitely guards. I saw the symbol on them. Finally get some oil for our lantern outside the Duchess's room. Hello. My warrior has come for me. Uh-oh. <clears throat> This spells trouble. You must think me a shameless harlot. Would that words could prove my love is pure. Off to a nice fire in after a long day's ruling, sire. No, you must hide. Oh yeah. There is a fool to fulfill that dragon. Hey, quickly. You storm the lady's bedchambers with the urgency of a man in battle. <laughs> <laughs> Hasn't shared the chamber since their wedding night. He knows exactly what's up. He knows. Oh, fear not. I shan't eavesdrop on the ducal proceedings. Yeah. I remain to stand watch at the guard, sire. For your protection, of course. <laughs> what is with that little jester? He's kind of a demon like creature. My lord, I've been. Would you had mentioned your coming, I might have dressed more finely. Uh oh. Uh, my lord! What are Lenore. you. Lenore! Lenore! Oh, Lord! Forgive me! <laughs> My Lord Edmund, is something wrong? Forgive me! I was wrong! I take it back, Lenore! What in the hell? What? I'm sorry! What I'm the sorry! Fuck? We're gonna watch him kill her? Holy shit. I don't know, should we have gone out there, guys? Kind of just did it. Well, what have I? Your Grace, Edmund, I... This isn't... This wicked fool mistook a trifling kindness that I once paid for something more. She stole into my room. I was terrified. This commoner must be made to learn, sire. Give her a taste of the lash and a stay in the dungeon. Festy! Festy, I know you're there! She's freaking out now. She's in trouble and she knows it. That's gonna blame everybody else. But that was jacked up. What is wrong with Edmund? Oh, Brook, none of your japes, fool! Summon the guards! Have this villain removed! Huh. I wish we had picked up that thing on the ground that was right there at first. Well now, what have we here? 
friend of the Duchess, sneaking off to her chambers for a cup of tea. Must be a fine tea. What to come all this way in the dead of night? Perhaps you see that would hurt so fucking sword. bad. Like a turn in the sheets with his grace's own wife. Damn, you're tougher than you seem. Perhaps there's aught to this arisen business after all. Who is this lady? Is crazy. We get the hell away from her. What, now she's trying to get us out of here? What is wrong with her? What have I done? I cannot ask forgiveness for this betrayal. But I was certain the Duke would cut me down where I stood had I not spoken so. <laughs> we get the hell out of here. This lady is freaking crazy. And her and the Duke deserve each other. And he's a nut. I don't know what's going on. Is he drunk or something like that? And he snapped out of it? He was like possessed by somebody. The Duke is half mad and fierce and wrath. I shall think of some way to assuage him. I'd run if I were you too, girl. I wonder if we can let him just choke her to death. Break any law and you may find yourself arrested and imprisoned. You can't use items or change equipment in the castle dungeons with few exceptions. Uh, okay. Sure am quick, though. Man, that was crazy. Wasn't that a crazy mission, guys? I mean, holy smokes. So we had to sneak through an area and we don't even have crouch. What else is there in these? Let's let everybody out of jail here. Anybody in here? I'm gonna let you guys all out. With an empty flask. Nothing in here. <clears throat> the first we had to meet her at night. Then we had to go up to the tower. Then we got caught in the tower. And the whole thing with Edmund choking her, that was surreal. He's like really crazy, mad with power or drunk at the time, I'm not sure which, but possessed by something. And they snapped out of it when the lightning struck, remember? I hear the wind howling through something. <gasps> Look at this. Isn't that so cool? The sound of the wind led me to that. Can I put my gear on yet? I do it in equipment. Forgot. I can't do it there. Prisoner's rags. I still can't equip. Damn. Okay. I mean, I feel like I'm. Ah! Ah! I feel like I'm out of the prison now. Please, Louise. Ah, I just gotta double jump everywhere. Damn rats, get out of here. More bugle. Okay, who cares? Punching a rat in the ass. Punch that rat ass. The lock opens. Cool. Okay. Well, once again, <laughs> these oh, missions are like gold in this game. I swear heart? to God. I, I, I hope to God that Dragon's Dogma 2 is like this. You've been through quite a trial, Arisen. I offer my. I appreciate it. Uh, bitches are nuts, and that's enough of that. Let's get our gear back on and get back to being the Arisen of Legend. Legend of the making, really. Now. wonder what it looks like with my prisoner rags underneath. No, you can't wear them underneath that. Lame. I like how in-depth all the inventory stuff is. Like, there's two sets of nails and, finger and rings you can wear, two sets of pants. Two sh an undershirt and an overshirt. That's just really cool. 
<laughs> okay, so now... Where are we? The Duke's Dements. Oh, this is over by the slums. Okay. We know where we're at. This is where we meet up with Mason and stuff like that. Yeah. Alright, we're free. Now, next mission here. Okay, we're gonna do the conspirators and continue on with that. We're gonna end the episode right here, guys. When we come back, we're gonna continue on with the conspirators quest and look for the long lost letter that Fidel wrote. Or Aldous? No, that's Fidel wrote that. Take care, you aren't soaked in water. And we'll see what's going on with the conspirators and all the treachery and mayhem that's about to ensue. Thanks for watching. I'm Lucky and the channel's game on. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.